Hello friends, this video trigonometry part 12 is brought to you by exampa.com. No more PA from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched trigonometry part 1 to part 11. In this slide, we will learn trigonometry functions. Sin of x plus y is equal to sin x cos y plus cos x sin y. Similarly, cos of x plus y is equal to cos x cos y minus sin x sin y. Tan of x plus y is equal to tan x plus tan y by 1 minus tan x tan y. Please note, we have to learn this, we have to memorize these formulas because these formulas are very important. We will keep using these formulas to solve various questions in trigonometry. Similarly, sin of x minus y is equal to sin x cos y minus cos x sin y. Cos of x minus y is equal to cos x cos y plus sin x sin y and tan of x minus y is equal to tan x minus tan y by 1 plus tan x tan y. It must be confusing because there are 6 formulas and it's very difficult to remember this. So we have a tip to remember. So for sine functions we have this line if you remember this line sun that is sine needs boss. Boss is cos. So here I am saying sin is sun and boss is cos. I think sun needs boss support to add. See this guy, this guy is sun. He needs boss support to add because he doesn't know how to add. So he wants to be together with boss. So if you see right, sin of x plus y, this is sin x cos y plus cos x sin y. So all these terms this son doesn't want to be alone. He wants to be with boss. That's why if you see son needs boss support to add. So son of x plus y is equal to son of some part into cos of some part plus cos of some part into sin of some part. That's just a tip to remember. Mathematically it doesn't have any sense but it's a good tip to remember. Similarly cos the boss, if you see right, this guy is a boss, is his uh, little bad. He wants to add alone. This guy wants to do things alone because he knows stuff. And this guy is poor son. This guy is poor son. He has chased him away. And he, he ignores the work done by the son. That's why you see, cause of x plus y, you see, that is, boss is doing all the part on his own. Cause of x into cause y minus he is ignoring, he is ignoring the work done by sin, that is minus sin of x sin of y. Just attempt to remember, sin of x plus y, that is when sun is assigned time task to add to number, he wants boss support always. So in first case he will say I will do x part, boss do y's part and in second case he will say I will do uh, y part and boss does x part. So that is sun of x plus y. In case of boss, boss will say I will do both part cos x cos y and he feels that this sun is good for nothing. So whatever part is done by sun, he will ignore that part. So that is minus sin x sin y. So that is a tip to remember this formula. Sun needs boss support. The sun needs support because sun is always needy. You see this guy is a needy. He is looking for this and cos boss wants to do things alone. So he'll say, I'll do things alone, cos x cos y, and he'll ignore. Please note, ignore is a crucial word. When you say ignore, that's why it's a negative term comes here. You notice it is x plus y, but still it is a negative here. So he ignores the work done by sun. So it is cos x cos y minus sin x sin y. Similarly, for negative, what if we have the formula for positive, what we do is just instead of positive, we replace negative. Here also, when it is positive, you make it negative. Similarly here also, cos of x plus y, this is negative, this is negative, this becomes correct. And tan of x plus y, is pretty simple formula, you can remember this. Tan of x plus y is equal to tan of x plus tan of y by 1 minus tan of x into tan of y. This is the pretty simple formula for tan of x plus y. 
not difficult to read because it's, it's a different actually, it's a different altogether in the form. So you can remember this. Let's take some examples. Let's find the value of sine 15 degree. So from our last slide we have written 0, 1 by 2, 1 by root 2, root 3 by 2 and 1. This is 0 degree, this is 30 degree, this is 45 degree, this is 60 degree and this is 90 degree. So we know these values, we know sine 30, we know sine 45, we know sine 60, we know sine 90 but we don't know the value of sine 50. So what we can do? We can say sine of 15 degree this guy equal to sine of 45 minus 30 degree or 45 degree minus 30 degree this we can say now we can apply the formula so the formula is sine of a minus b so the sine of a minus b we know this is sun so he wants to do things with the boss so we will say, in first case he will do part A, boss will do part B, that is negative, so I will put negative. Then cos, boss will do part A and sun will do part B. So this is the formula of sine of A minus B. For the picture also we can make out. So now we can say this is equal to sine of 45 cos of 30 minus cos of 45 degree into sine of 30 degree this is degree sine of 45 degree is this one 1 by root 2 cos of 30 is this one because this is for sine for cos it was other way around we have shown let me write here 0 30 45 60 90 so this was for sine this is for cos. We know this. So cos of 30 is root 3 by 2 into root 3 by 2 minus cos of 45 is again 1 by root 2 and then sin 30 is sin 30 is this one 30 1 by 2. So this is what we have got. We will take common or this is equal to 2 root 2 and this is root 3 minus 1. So this is the answer. So what we have done, we wanted to find the value of sine 15 degree, we knew 45 and 30, so we have used this formula, we have written sine 15 is equal to sine 45 mi minus 30 degree, expanded this using this formula and then got the answer. Let's take some more example of trigonometric functions. So if you have to find the value of tan 13 by 12 pi, so we know that tan of 13 by 12 pi, we can also write 13 by 12 if you divide what you gave it is 1, 1 by 12. So this becomes tan of pi plus pi by 12. Correct. So also we know that tan repeats after every pi, we have shown you sin and cos repeats after every 2 pi and tan repeats after every pi. So this becomes tan of pi by 12. Now pi by 12 is in radian form. Let's convert into degree because we know all the values in degree. We are more comfortable with that. So we know that uh, pi is equal to 180 degree. So we'll say this is equal to tan of 180 degree by 12. Correct. And this will come out to be tan of 15 degree. So now we have to find the value of tan 15 degree. So we know tan 45, we know tan 30. So we will say tan of 15 degree is equal to tan of 45 degree minus 30 degree. This we can say. And now we can use the formula. We have tan of A minus B. This guy equals to tan A minus tan B by 1 plus tan A tan. Just now we have learned this formula. This guy is going to like this one. We will use the same formula here. So tan A is equal to tan 45 degree. 
माइनस टेन थर्टी डिग्री बाय वन माइनस टेन फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री इंटू टेन थर्टी डिग्री नॉ टेन फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री वी नो इज वन टेन थर्टी वी नो इज वन बाय रूट थ्री एंड वन दिस इज प्लस सॉरी सो दिस गाइस इज़ वन प्लस टेन फोर्टी फाइव इज़ वन इंटू टेन थर्टी वन बाय रूट थ्री सो व्हाट यू गोट इज़ वन माइनस वन बाय रूट थ्री बाय वन प्लस वन बाय रूट थ्री दैट्स व्हाट यू गोट सो लेट्स लेट्स रैशनलाइज़ दिस सो हियर वी गोट रूट थ्री माइनस वन बाय रूट थ्री एंड हियर यू गोट रूट थ्री प्लस वन बाय रूट थ्री कैंसल दिस यू गेट रूट थ्री माइनस वन बाय रूट थ्री प्लस वन सो आई राइट हियर एक्चुअली वी गेट रूट थ्री माइनस वन बाय रूट थ्री प्लस वन वी कैन रैशनलाइज दिस आल्सो सो वील डिवाइड एंड मल्टीप्लाई बाय रूट थ्री माइनस वन करेक्ट सो व्हाट यू गेट रूट थ्री माइनस वन होल स्क्वायर बाय वील गेट रूट थ्री माइनस वन होल स्क्वायर बाय एंड दिस इज ए स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर बिकॉज ए प्लस बी इंटू ए माइनस बी सो वॉट यू गॉट ए स्क्वायर इज थ्री माइनस बी स्क्वायर इज वन एंड दिस वी गेट रूट थ्री होल स्क्वायर इज थ्री ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर माइनस टू ए बी बाय टू सो वी गेट फोर माइनस टू रूट थ्री बाय टू एंड दैट इज इक्वल टू टू माइनस रूट थ्री दैट इज द आंसर वी कैन ऑल्सो से दिस इज द आंसर एनी ऑफ दिस इज द आंसर but we just wanted to simplify it so we made it 2 minus root 3 and that's how the value of tan 15 degree thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again